Hi guys, I'm CA Gitika Bajaj and I'm a QuickBooks Pro Advisor and today we are going to learn about what is the difference between avoided and a deleted transactions in QuickBooks Online. So let's get started. So basically, uh, voided and deleted have the same effect on the financial statements. That means the effect gets removed. But in voided transactions, what happens is see this invoice. So if I void it, the attachment in it is still going to be there. So let me just show you. So when I'm voiding it and uh, okay, so here I'm voiding it and I go to accountant tools and go to this voided deleted transactions list and there I see this has been voided. So the main advantage of voiding is the attachment is still here. Secondly, if you if you voided it by mistake or you want to reinstate that invoice, again, you can add the value, whatever was here and just save it. So the reactivating the voided invoice is very much possible. But once if a transaction is deleted, the attachment is gone and also the if you want to reactivate it it's not possible uh the only thing that's possible is you have to recreate that invoice again and uh, just one help quickbooks gives us is that you can see the audit history what was the original thing and you have to recreate it so while if you void it's it's instantly done now that's the difference between voided and a deleted transaction i hope it helps